So we thought we'd show you around Muskegon. We have a beautiful town here. Uh, we're right by Lake Michigan. There's a lot to see. We have a Silverside submarine. We have tugboats. We have um, beach and places to go. And I think it's a fun place. So come along and check us out. The USS Silversides was one of the most successful submarines in the Pacific theater of World War II, with 23 confirmed sinkings totaling over 90,000 long tons of shipping. She received a Presidential Unit Citation for cumulative action over four patrols and 12 battle stars. She presently serves as a museum ship in Muskegon, Michigan and is a National Historic Landmark. Michigan is normally a very gloomy place to be in the winter time but today there's some sunshine peeking out and a lot of people are out they're taking walks with their dogs or with uh, their loved ones and it's a good day today so I'm happy to be out here Muskegon Lake is a 4,150-acre freshwater lake. Several public and private marinas and boat launch facilities are located along the shores of Muskegon Lake, and recreational sailing and boating are popular activities. Sport fishing is also popular in Muskegon Lake, where king salmon, coho salmon, steelhead, brown trout, lake trout, and hey, birds are Hey, here we are found. in front of Muskegon Lake. Uh, which is a really large lake. It's the biggest one in Muskegon County. Behind us here is where you enter the channel and the lake connects to Lake Michigan. We get a lot of big ships through there. Um, we're a shipping port here in Muskegon and that's where they enter, right over there by the lighthouse. The USS LST-393 is an LST-1 class tank landing ship built for the United States Navy during World War II. She is one of only two LSTs to survive in original configuration. 1,051 were built. She is now a museum ship in Muskegon, Michigan. Behind me is the LST that has served in World War II. And in 1944, it was at the Battle of Normandy. And Normandy is in France, just in case you didn't know. And it has earned three battle stars for Normandy for Sicily in 1943, I believe, and then for another conflict in World War II. And um, right now it is a museum. You can go there and watch movies on summer nights. I guess you can do yoga. You could just take tours and look at all the fine gun machinery. And it's just awesome. We are glad to have this bit of history here in Muskegon, which is awesome.